Hi guys, Pete Finch here and welcome down to another FSX Skills Challenge. Guys, if you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, make sure you hit that like button and please comment below on everything that you see in today's video. Now, we've been doing these challenges for about two years now and I've got a high score of 53 points. Now, the world record is 58 points, so I'm edging closer and closer. If you don't know how the skills challenge works, it's pretty simple. You get 14 stations on the FSX skills software. You've got one shot at each station. You've got a bullseye ring on the target. If you get an inner ring, a blue ring, that's five points, three points for a white ring, and then one point for an outer green. If you miss the target completely, then you get zero. And what I've done recently with these challenges, I've blocked some time out of my diary or went up at the academy, and then left myself a good couple of hours to have a go at this. And what I'm doing is having multiple goes, multiple goes multiple goes to try and get the best score that I possibly can on that day. I've also been learning from the past experiences that I've had so taking on plenty of water actually smashed the Red Bull before this particular challenge as well. This is not an ad although Red Bull if you um taking practice swings, going through a little bit more of a full pre-shot routine before the shots as well. So let's get over to the academy and let's see how I got on. I think this was maybe my fifth or sixth attempt of the challenge so enjoy hopefully you'll enjoy i did you know that's to reassess how i'm playing that shot totally because well, that should never have got there in a million years on the old software but times are changing so when he pitches short it just runs on a lot quicker off the fringe stops on the fairway stops on the green gotta be so much more precise so, a little flop shot here, semi-flop. And we'll do that same shot. Just a little bit further with the swing to get to the 30. Yep. Okay, tickle on nicely. 50 yards, this is the one that Desperate to get in here. 60 yards. Desperate to get the 60 in. Come on. Oh, is it in? Must be. No, that's never three. Never three. <laughs> That'll do. Okay, 50 degrees. Come on, fives are rolling. Ah, <sighs> oh, I don't like missing on those short ones because I feel so comfortable on them. 120, come on, Pete. You said to yourself, this is the day. This is the day that you're gonna do it. It. Oh, I've got so, so lucky on that one. That's a fringing in. Come on, come on. 150, where's my nine? Uh, with the new software, so what I've noticed is that it doesn't actually go uh, as far. I don't feel like it does anyway, unless I'm just having a bad day. But 165 yards is normally a really hard eight, but it's actually a seven now. So that's what I feel like anyway. So seven, nine, come on, let's keep it going. 41 after this would be good. Maybe slightly right. Just a side of it. Ah. 25 left on the table to play with. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, yeah. Get a good kick for me. Settle, settle, settle. Settle down. Settle down. Settle down! <laughs> Woo! Uh, okay, that was good, needed. Um, 200 yards, jeez. Come on. Come on. Get the kick. 
Get the kick. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Come on. So, 215. 215. So, this is going to be a four iron, just a little bit more of a full one. <sighs> Didn't quite catch it. Go on. Get one. It's all I deserved. I didn't quite catch that. 230 yards. Well, folks, it comes down to this. I've got 50 points. Two targets remaining. Obviously, if I get a five on either of these, I'm going to surpass it. But I've got a chance with two fives to actually get top of the tree, top of the leaderboard. 230. I either rocket this four iron or I hit a little one with the two. Ah, it's got to be the little two, I think. Oh, come on. Come on. Soft bounce. Soft bounce for me. Soft bounce. I mean, I couldn't... I couldn't have actually played that any better. Well, obviously I could have. <laughs> stupid, stupid thing to say. Of course I could have played that better, but... It was pretty much bang on where I wanted to be. However, a three or a five pointer here. Come on. Now, <laughs> I've got the M5 in the bag. I've been practicing with it, but I got fit for a new driver uh, a couple of days ago. And it wasn't this one. Come on. Oh my God, I've absolutely ripped it. Stay. Please stay. Oh. Well, listen, it, it, ain't, it ain't 56, but that is 54. That is 54. <laughs> Round of applause, everyone. Oh, I really need to get some company while I'm doing these things. 54. All right. And there we go, guys. A new high score for myself of 54 points. Edging ever closer to that 58 number managing to break my best because at this stage when the points get really high it is just about those very fine margins and there were a couple of shots there that just went in the three when it could have gone in the five that could have changed the complete complexion of this challenge i could have been home and dry but as it is I am not, and it continues that quest for 59 points. And also with these challenges, guys, I probably will be changing my entire bag of clubs quite soon. So it could take a little bit of adaption to get used to, but I'll be making more announcements on that very soon. So guys, thank you so much for watching this challenge. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Comment on the video and like as well. All my other social media are linked in the description below, as is the Swing Quest book, uh, which has suddenly, for some reason, started to peak with people buying it again. I don't know why. I've just looked at it this morning, which is probably why I'm saying this. So that's all below as well. So guys, thank you so, so much for watching, and we'll see you down here next time.